It's a Thursday and you're watching America's first and only daily talk show for and about the Filipinos where every day for the last how many weeks we have been inviting you to come and join us. Travel to Taiwan. For the third time, this is a, a joint uh, project between LA18 and uh, Taiwan Tourist Bureau where we bring some of our viewers to Taiwan. We are leaving on April 1st and this is a very affordable, very, very good package. This is probably the best package that you can find anywhere else. You cannot find this anywhere else. Um, this includes your ticket from LA to Taipei. We travel, we go around Taiwan for five days and six nights. It includes all the accommodations, all the meals, all the tours. We are going to learn how to cook Taiwanese dishes. We're we're going to a big uh, tea plantation called Shangri-La. We're going to learn to fly lanterns. We're going to do a lot of wonderful things. And at the end of the trip, you also get a ticket from Taipei to Manila, where it's open dated for three months, where you can spend time with your friends and loved ones and relatives in the Philippines as well. I hope you join me. And that, like I said earlier, we are leaving on April 1st. So call now. Meanwhile, back here on Cabo Bay in LA, congratulations are in order for our beautiful guest, Pia, Pia Gladys Perret. Hello and welcome to Cabo Bay in LA. Hello, thank you for having me here. And congratulations, very successful show last night at Style Fashion Week LA. How do you feel? Oh, I, am, I feel so blessed. I'm so lucky and I'm just ecstatic right now. I'm like everywhere, like I don't know, how, cloud nine. Yeah, what for <laughs> you was the highlight of the night? I was there, thank you so much by the way for the invitation. Well, thank, thank you, you to Elgin and thank you to uh, Al as well, whom you will meet earlier, uh, whom you will meet later. Um, what was the highlight of the night? I was there, some of the previous fashion shows were delayed and so we didn't mm -hmm. get on till later in the night. And I even saw you mingle with some of your guests mm -hmm, before, which is not typical. Usually designers are, you know, in the backstage and they don't go out till after mm -hmm. their show is done. What was that decision? Where did that decision come from? Well, I like to meet the people that, you know, who watch the show, like have be in contact with them and just discuss what the collection is about just to get to know them more. So I really enjoy that. So. You look very relaxed, too, while some designers are, you know, excited, anxious, nervous. You are just so steady. Well, I think it's because I have a good team. Yeah, I have a very good team, so and we prepared everything in advance, so everything runs smoothly. We're also going to be meeting the team later on in the program, but Gladys, wonderful collection. Thank you. A lot of, uh, I've been saying since earlier, a lot of uh, vibrant colors, mm -hmm. a lot of drapes, and um, I like that you're using this kind of material. Is it jersey? Because it's so easy to wear that, especially here in the States when you don't have to iron it. Yeah, it's actually wrinkle free, mm -hmm. so a lot of people who travel really favor it because mm -hmm. it's, you could just take it out of your suitcase and then you're ready to go. Exactly. So yeah, we, I use um, silky jersey which feels very nice on the skin. It's like, it's almost like, it feels like, you know, sleepwear. So right, it's really and nice. with the drapes it also looks sexy, mm -hmm. exactly, because it, 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 it accentuates the curves. And covers. And covers. <laughs> <Exactly. laughs> <Needs to be covered. laughs> yeah, so when you make your designs, who do you design for? Who's on your mind? The real women. Mm -hmm. I always take into consideration, you know, how a woman goes through, you know, changes mm -hmm. in her life, like from, from, and I take so much pride that I can dress up like a, a, a girl at 16 years old mm -hmm. and like, maybe until a woman till like she's 60 so wow. it takes so much pride in that so yeah like what I was saying a woman goes through so many body changes you know when they get pregnant when you know they go through menopause they yeah. go through everything so <laughs> right. I always keep that in mind and you're there for them any muses any muse like inspiration um, who do you look up to be it a personality or a model that you know when you make your designs it's you know you're thinking about them well, I always take into consideration, like, um, of course, I love Angelina Jolie, not just because she wore my dress, yes. but I love the effortless style that she has. Mm -hmm. You know, it's not fuzzy. You know, right. it's, it's so easy, but at the same time, she's elegant. And, like, you know, she's always um, very, you know, what she wears now, right now, mm -hmm. I, can, I could see, like, women wearing it, like, in real life. Yeah. yeah. You dropped a name right there. Angelina Jolie has worn your design. Um, Kim Kardashian, mm -hmm. um, uh, Eva Longoria. So, and in, uh, bef even before your show last mm -hmm. night, you are already known globally. So you debuted your fashion line in Australia. Yes, so you're right. what we're calling the a global pride. Okay. So what took so long? Why did it take three years before you came to L.A.? 
Well, I wanted to take my time and, you know, um, I want to feel that I'm very ready to, to you know, to sell in the U.S. market and uh, to find the right team. Because the last time I did a fashion show was in Miami. Mm -hmm. And, yeah, I like when I did that, it, my, my team was not as solid as this one. Okay. So this is my third time, actually, to get invited. Mm -hmm. And w I, I was so blessed to meet Ao and Mao mm -hmm. and then to know that they have so many Filipino, you know, Contacts. friends here yes, yeah, who yes. are very keen to help. Like, right. they really help me all the way. So. That's the Bayanihan spirit. Yes, you. The, Filipinos yes, helping the, fellow mm -hmm, Filipinos, mm -hmm, right? So, yeah, that's, that's like, I was so relieved to know. So I'm like, okay, let's do it. Yes, mm -hmm. you've been talking about your team. And, uh, you know, we should probably introduce your team mm -hmm. to our viewers. And that's when we return on the show. Don't go away.